Hello, this is Keen Krazi, aka Dayani, um, from Pagel. I am making a quick little video here to show how to use um, WoW Sims with Pawn. So, um, let's see, if you look over, change. Oh, I'm already on the scene. If you look at Pawn, the default values look something like this. So it has all three loaded up. And if you go in here, um, Pawn is saying um, from my arcane spec that these pants are a 5% upgrade to my current pants right now. Um, that's with the default weights in here. And what we're going to do is we're going to get rid of these. So I'm just going to deselect them as show this scan and tooltips. I'm going to deselect those. <clears throat> I'm going to jump over to WoW Sims. Um, here in WoW Sims, uh, it's going to look like something like this by default. It'll have the current gear set. So if you've never used WoW Sims before, um, you fill it out with what you got. Um, I already have mine saved. So I'm going to switch over to my Arcane Raid set here. Um, make sure that you do select the correct talents. And you set your settings for what your typical um, buffs are going to be. Um, I had to change mine a little bit. Make sure you set your race and your professions in here as well. Um, it goes for like the absolute maximum buffs that you can get. I'm not quite that try hard. So I did remove some things. Um, then make sure that you have your rotation set up correct down here. This is going to be different for every class. Um, for a uh, mage, for an arcane mage here, we just have some settings to do with our arcane blast stuff. If I were to switch over to fire, it would ask me what my main rotation spell is, whether I'm spec for frostfire or something else. But anyways, pay attention to these settings. Make sure these are correct. Um, and then you can save them here. Okay, so now that we have our gear selected, what we're going to do is we're going to simulate. Uh, I like to simulate a couple times. Then we're going to select our stat weight button here. And we're going to leave an EP. I don't know what EP stands for. There's EP and weights. EP is what we use with Pawn. I don't know exactly how it's calculated. But anyways, we're just going to hit calculate here. <clears throat> now what's it, what this is doing is it's, from what I understand, it's adding 100 to each of your stats at a time and it's running simulations what would it be like if we had 100 more of this 100 more intellect what would it be like if we had 100 more spear what would it be like if we had 100 more spell damage um and then based on those results it calculates what stats you should be giving priority to so you see right here from the default what you load into it, it's saying that intellect's more important, spirit is not as important, spell damage is the same. It's saying MP5 is better, even though you'd be silly to take that. It's saying I don't need spell hit is taken down to zero. Don't, I'm, I'm capped for spell hit. Spell crit slightly down and haste quite a bit down. Um, that doesn't mean necessarily that it's saying haste is not as valuable. It's just saying. In comparison to my spell crit, the gap is closer for these two, if that makes any sense. Based on the, the simulations that it ran. So I'm going to hit this little button. You got to hit this little button right here. Copy to current EP. And now when you go to look at gear, these points here are going to be now be based on your calculated EP. Now the fun thing where it comes in the play with pawn is we're gonna hit export pawn EP. Copy this to clipboard. And we're gonna come back over to wow. We're gonna click on our pawn button and we're gonna say import. And we're gonna paste that value in here. Now what I, I like to change this name a little bit. And the color uh, for my fire one, I colored it more fire. Um, I'm going to rename it to 
arcane raid. Bada bing, bada boom. I got it showing. I'll show my fire. I did the same thing for my fire spec. And now, let's see what it thinks about these pants now. They're not an upgrade. So this is very important if you're using pawn because your values are going to change based on what you're wearing. Uh, until you get your best in slot, which right now is what, 258 gear? Until you get that best in slot set, the things that are going to be upgrades for you are not going to be what the default pawn values are. And they're not going to be what the default EP stat weights are in Wild Sims either. You have to be calculating your DPS and updating your EP values in order to use Wild Sims and pawn correctly. It's something I don't think a lot of people are doing. And it might be causing you to lose some some potential DPS. That's all. Thank you.